out there somewhere. I'm not sure if you remember this girl, but this is Kalani Stern, and I just realized I spelled her name wrong in my video, but it's okay. Look at her! Yes, you see her again. You know who else you see again? Aurora McLean. And one last person you also see again, Miss Krista Swan. Okay, guys. But da 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 da. If you have seen by the title before you clicked on this video, this is my new LP called Differences. Um, it's not get to work, but at the same time it is get to work. Uh -huh. Um, so this is somewhat my get to work LP, I guess you can call it. But yeah, um, this is called Differences because there's three people that are not really alike. But yet they're tied together and it just works. Um, Miss Krista, one thing that they do have in common <clears throat> that was like very special that I really wanted them to have in common is they all have like different colored hair. She has bright purple hmm. hair. She has navy blue hair. And she has a hair color that cannot be defined. It is purple and pink. At first, I knew I wanted to give her pink, but I wasn't sure if I wanted. I didn't want to give her something bright like this, or this was a little too pale and stuff, so I went with something different, like this color right here. Okay, and there's a reason why I didn't want to give her such a bright color hair, and I will explain in her backstory. Miss Krista Swan, Miss Krista Swan, Miss Krista Swan. Okay, there's so much information I could give on Miss Krista. She grew up being very proper. I guess you could say um she was always very modest honestly these ripped jeans that she's currently wearing isn't even really her style like what her <clears throat> i just don't really have a pair of black jeans that aren't ripped honestly yeah honestly i don't so those are kind of like my only oh. option of jeans because yeah i don't have any black jeans unless i downloaded some yeah, i don't like those or, well these aren't these are just small rips so either way she's always been very covered up and modest because her mom um mainly because of her parents she is not a big fan of showing skin her mom probably wouldn't even really like her wearing this top right here but because she is covered um they may approve of it i'm pretty sure her mom would approve it much better if she's wearing a jacket or something but that's not gonna happen so um she's particularly small except for her chest oh, area yeah. it's a little bigger and that's one thing about her that her mother's always been like oh cover that up save that for your husband and stuff and don't woohoo until you're married and stuff like that and she tries her best to obey her mother's ways she's very neat she always cleaned up she's active because she likes to stay fit and she's jealous because she's always you know had the idea of the perfect boyfriend and um them being so committed to her so yeah this is miss krista the proper little girl and she's just the quote unquote good girl but um as they say good girls are bad girls that just mm. haven't been caught so um when she dyed her hair her mother of course was not pleased about it so she wanted something not so out there like this bright pink um something a little more subtle that maybe her mom would yell at her a little less about so yeah that's where that hair color came from and she just wants to be the leader of the pack, honestly. Um, she wants to be able to lead and prove her mom that she can do something good. So this is her every day. I think this is her only oh. every day, yeah. This is her formal, again, very covered. I know in the video it's something different, but this is something from Get to Work and it's much more, again, covered. As her mother would like it. And I gave her this, but actually I kind of like this better on her. Yeah, I like this a lot better on her, actually. This is her athletics, so yes, covered. Her mother might even tell her to zip that zipper up a little bit more. 
So her sleepwear, her mother doesn't see her at night, so she wears whatever she wants to sleep, but she still respects her mother's orders of covering it up. Ah. And then it comes to party. She tried to pretty much cover it up, and then her mom would have saw these shorts and been like, no boo, change. And then her second party wear is where it really goes down. It's when her mother's not even close to visual expectations, and this is when she gets to show out and not have to worry about her mother. So. Yes, she is a bit of a party girl. And that's another thing with the active. She likes to keep her body in shape and nice. And then her swim too. She likes to yeah, she likes to show off her body. But also like if she was doing something where her mom was to appear, she would be covered. Hmm. So yeah, I don't like that bathing suit on her. So let's give her another bathing suit for if her mom was to appear. I'm not sure if I want to put their parents in. Um, let me know if you guys want their parents in the Let's Play. <coughs> Just her mother, probably. Her dad wouldn't be in the picture. Probably. Ah. If I was to do a Let's Play, he wouldn't mm. be in the picture. Yeah, his her mom pretty much... I'm not gonna say... Uh, dad, I meant dad. I'm not gonna say died, but... Um, he's not existent to her. Whoa. Okay. But yeah, he's non existent to her and it's never been a big part of her life because yeah, he died. I don't know why I said I'm not gonna say he died, because he did die. And he died when she was a young age, so it was her mother's responsibility to raise her. And then you have Mr. Warren McLean. Yes, Miss McLean. Um yeah, she's always had the family. <coughs> I'm sorry. She's always had her full family. She had a lot of brothers and sisters. But there wasn't a lot of chaos. So she was kind of just a chill one. That's why she's not wearing too much. She's basically in like just casual shirt and a beanie. She's so chill. And she's very go with the flow. And then she doesn't like to express her emotions very much. Especially at people. Because... She likes to stay chill and not create problems, so she expresses it oh. in her creativity in painting. Yama? She is an insider because Hello. everywhere else she is not very like out there, but once she's in there with her group, she is all good and um, they have such hey, a great time Kangaroo. together. And she just <laughs> loves being with her group. Um, and then, you know, with the whole painting, she loves art, and she's outgoing, because, like I said, when she's out there with her group, she is all the way there. So, yeah, her everyday wears are pretty chill. She likes to just keep it low-key. Her formal wear, again, she doesn't like to do too much. And her hair is in braids, so it makes sense for her hair to be something like this, because, honestly, when you have your hair in, like, uh -huh. fishtails or whatever, um, not fishtails, I don't know why I said fishtails, Corn rolls and stuff, when you take it out, it turns into wavy like this. So this honestly was a little like quick thing for her to do. It did not take much. Also, she doesn't wear much makeup because of this as well. Um, it's just so easy to put on a little bit of lipstick and keep rolling. It's her active. Her sleep. And also, if you didn't know, she is a little bigger. I wanted her to be on a bigger side. Um, she's always been bullied about her weight, and so now she turned it into a good thing. And I guess that's another reason why she's so chill. She's never been an active child. Um, and then this is her party. There's that one, and then there is this one. I love this top from Get Together, so props to them on that. And this is her swim. <coughs> yeah, so she's been bullied about her weight a lot. <coughs> And you can see it in her, like... Mm. But that's another thing with the art. When she gets bullied and stuff, she just puts into her art to express her emotion, and then things get better. <sighs> then you have Miss Kalani! Ah. So, Miss Kalani here is an out-there person. I'm not going to say she was a rebel, but she wasn't the type of obey your parents kid. When she was a teen, she liked to party and enjoy life. And she's still at that stage of enjoying life. But, I mean, 
one day it hit her in the head. She needed to do something with her life. So that's when she decided to become a DJ. Yes, she's going to become a DJ. But her parents still aren't happy with that. But she's got to the point where she doesn't care what her parents think. She wants to be serial romantic because her parents honestly never had a true steady relationship. They try to hide things from her, but she knows what's really going on. She knows that they have other people and stuff. Um, so she has a little brother. That Her little brother is actually her like dearest connection. And she tries her best to keep him like... She tells him what's going on, and she wants to make sure he knows the truth, because they can't hide it from him. And she'd rather not see her brother suffer uh -huh. in hiding, and just rather just let him know the truth. So yes, he does know, and she is like her little guardian. But growing up knowing that her parents had all these secrets, kind of had her growing up to be a serial romantic and she <laughs> is very romantic she knows so how to play cool. people all the way she's outgoing she loves being out there and just at the party and everything and then she's also a dance machine because who doesn't love to dance <clears throat> so miss kalani her shirt says it all she does not care she wants you to see everything she wants to flaunt her stuff and she's confident she's confident that is for sure so yeah, she wears a lot of crop tops and halter tops and see-through things, again, see-through, and then crop tops. I don't know why I didn't really give her a crop top for her sleepwear, but it does say fierce because, uh, <coughs> well, isn't she quite a fierce girl? I mean, I think so. Her party wear, oh my gosh, I actually like this so much. It is so different and I love it. She looks like she's meant to be from the future and it's so adorable. And this is her swimwear, again, flaunting her stuff. <coughs> Definitely putting it out there. So, Miss, oh, by the way, guys, I'm a little sick. It's probably obvious. Yeah, I know, but I just couldn't wait to play and I really wanted to play so bad. So now I'm going to kind of like show you guys the differences between them all. Um, Miss Krista here covers up. And Miss Kalani does not cover. And then Kalani is out there and is confident. Where Aurora is not confident. She's not there yet. She's pretty comforter comfortable. She doesn't really want to be out there dancing and showing off. Krista, she mm. wants her body to look good. Same like Kalani. And I mean, they all want to look good, but she works extra hard at it. <coughs> And then they all grew up with different lifestyles. So yes, they are all three di very different people. But trust me, they come together as one. They definitely do. She's wearing jeans. I almost want to put her in like a little preppy skirt. And I actually did this earlier, but then I was like, you know what, I'm just going to put her back in jeans. But I actually like her in the skirt better now. Oh my gosh, I am so indecisive. I think I like, I think I like this better. All right, let's put them in, let's play now. The Swan household, they will be on the gallery. Let's change that picture up. Sure. Oh. At Modelo YT is my hashtag, hashtag Modelo YT, and my origin ID is Juanita M12, <coughs> J-U-A-N-I-T-A M12. Guys, I just want to say I'm so excited to see Windenburg. I've never been there before. And, yeah, I'm excited. And, um, I will be giving them extra, like, unlimited funds for their house. And I will be choosing a pre-made house from Windenburg. So, um, free real estate one. I don't know why it says unable to execute command. Okay, testing sheets. What? What is this? All right, guys, I will be right back. Honestly, I do not know what the problem was, but we're good now. So this is a three by two, and there's someone in there, but whatever. We can always move them out. Um, this is three by two place as well, and I like that place. <clears throat> okay. Who? Who? I'm gonna cough. 
know why all these places are filled. Okay, so I'm either gonna move into this house or this house. Well, I may love to live on this island and I bet that house is beautiful. I feel like everyone's let's play is living there. So I'm gonna live in this house right here and we can just kick them out. What? Yeah, evict. Yes, I want to evict them. Force furnished. All right. <coughs> so we have a new house. And so how they all met is like, they were at a party, of course. And they just thought, they thought they were so similar because they all had their hair dyed and you know, when they're at the party, they all like to show off and... Well, not show off, but they all like to have a good time and look cute. So they were like, oh yeah, she's my type. We're gonna be best friends. And then they kind of got moved in together and now they're soon gonna realize they're not so much alike. But when they go out and have a good time, that's when they're so much alike. Like, that is when it all clicks and they're like, wow. There is a reason that we came together. I don't know when we're going to get in. I hope it's soon. Okay, good. Oh, I'm so excited for our new house, guys. Okay, let's do a pause and do a tour. A tour, yes. <clears throat> okay, so this is the bathroom. Boom. One, well, one bathroom with a shower. Okay, and then, oh, that's pretty. I like this area. We have a big, whoa. Okay, this is amazing. <clears throat> bathroom number one. Oh my gosh, this kitchen is gold. <coughs> Dining room, yes. Page up, okay. Bathroom number two. This bedroom, yes. This is amazing. They already have the DJ kit. Okay, stop moving. And then they already have the exercise room for, yes. And then bedroom. Oh my gosh, this is so perfect, guys. There's like no edits that needs to be done to this except for getting a, um. What is this? Oh, it's a closet, okay. <coughs> God, I'm dying. <coughs> One of these. Uh, um, whoa, what's this? Regular games for. <coughs> I will probably explore all the buy mode stuff in like a creative. Uh, I mean, not a creative. <coughs> and let's build. Gosh, I haven't chose the rooms yet. What am I doing? gonna buy it okay let's put this out here <coughs> <coughs> dying by the second okay i need some like water i'll be right so back. it is 10 of 7 p.m and oh my gosh this kitchen is amazing why didn't i have like a cook a skilled cook <clears throat> i feel like something's supposed to be here and it's missing what's missing <laughs> get it together this fountain is beautiful oh my god oh <gasps> This is the per oh my gosh. This is so pretty. Oh my gosh. I just, okay, all the anticipation is building inside of me and I'm so happy. So this room right here, I'm thinking this room can either be Krista's or Aurora's. And then upstairs, I'm thinking that this room right here is definitely gonna be probably Kalani's. It's very like out there and a little different. And then, actually, no. This room is going to be Aurora's. This orange and everything, it's perfect for her. And then Krista, you know, she's the leader. So her house gets, her room gets to be the downstairs bedroom. The only thing I don't like is how everyone gets a computer and she doesn't. So we'll probably give her a computer. Yeah. I don't know where I'm going to put it, though. What's this? Sit nap. I might like remove her closet and put it there. Okay, guys, I'm so excited. What's the first thing we should do? Cause they moved it. Oh, join a club. Okay, ooh, I wanna get them jobs though. Ugh. Okay, jobs are first because money is priority. Money is priority. Okay. I wonder if DJ is an official job. Oh, club tutorial. Life is better with friends. Ooh, I did not mean to click this, but okay, sure. No, okay, can I like come to this after? I did not mean to do that. I must have joined a career. 
I want them all to join a career and then we'll figure out from there. Wow, I really did not think this through. Okay. So being a DJ is not a club in itself. I mean, not a job in itself. So, <clears throat> oh wait, this is Krista. Okay, Krista wants to be a leader. So maybe she'll be a detective. Or she could do business. I feel like her parents would want her to be a doctor. I'm having her be a detective though. I think her parents would be fine with that. Her mom would be fine with that, I think. Whoa, 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 what is going on here? I told you guys to join jobs. And the only one with a career right now is Krista. Wait, oh gosh, you're not even going towards your right bed. You sleep in this bed. So Kalani, ooh, okay. I think we'll just throw her an entertainer. Or secret agent, or no, entertainer. Yeah, definitely entertainer. And then Aurora is a painter. This is great, okay. Now, Aurora is going to the right bed. You are not. You need to be going to this bed. <gasps> what the freak is a disco nap? No, stop. Stop, do a disco nap. <coughs> Please, oh my gosh, no, get up and do a disco. What is... Take a disco nap, please. What? Uh. Does anyone see a difference? The thing I see is her body like glitching out. Okay, just go to sleep. There's no point in the disco nap. She's not sleeping. <coughs> oh my gosh, I can't stop admiring this house. Yes, we got the best house on the planet. Okay. Imagine this house. I wonder how all the other ones look if this one's this good. Okay, I would delete those posters up. So she just woke up and just started dancing. So she wants to watch romantic TV all and meet someone new. We are definitely meeting someone new. Um, Krista as the lead of the house. So actually, I feel like Aurora might be a cook. Okay, Um, I don't know. This might be hard. Ooh, I'm just going to do like a quick eeny, meeny, miny, mo to figure it out. <clears throat> okay, so I think the cook will be Aunt Krista, yeah. Uh, yeah, Krista can be a good cook. So Krista's gonna wake up this, or maybe we'll start off with just a caterer because a service sim is coming your way. Oh, Lord Kalani's gonna try to cook. Yeah, you should have been like, just got a bowl of cereal. Alright, so it looks like they're getting along. This is great! <coughs> this is so great. Eat your garden salad, boo! Hi! Oh my gosh. Where is my caterer? Girl, no one has time to cook in this house. Where is my caterer? Wait, 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 work. Wait, okay, it says a sim hired by Chris the Swan is on their way, but no sims are here. Ooh, look at this. <clears throat> okay. There's no work today. I don't care what job you are. <clears throat> yeah, you are not going to work today. You are taking a vacation day. So they both don't work today. Well, none of them work today now. Light a bonfire? Oh my gosh, that'd be amazing. And sell a painting, sure. Um, and she wants to join a new club, of course, boo. And buy a dishwasher. Oh, yes, I would love that. And look at her working out already. Listen to music, okay. <coughs> she could control panel. Hire staff. This is awesome, okay. I'll think about that in a little bit. Um. I don't know where my caterer is at. That's what I'm wondering, because people are hungry and no one has time for this. Let's buy the dishwasher now. So this just looks so empty for some, like what is supposed to be here? Let's just put,
Yeah, it actually kind of looks like... It kind of looks like all these counters are supposed to be like lined up from here. Like the counters are supposed to continue. Yeah, okay, we enhanced our kitchen. Now we need... <clears throat> we need a dishwasher. Where are they at, boo? I need like electronics. I mean, yeah. Oh, appliances. Electric appliances. Okay, here is the dishwasher. Boom. It must match the color scheme, boo. Okay, um, I really want my caterer con. So let's start with these clubs. So Krista, as a leader, will be making the club. Become energized. So join a club. So club manager. The club manager is where you can join a club, create a club, or learn more about specific clubs. You can join up to three clubs. Apply for an invite. An invite only club requires your sim to be friends with a member. In order to join, your sim can apply for an invite, and they will be invited to the club's next gathering. So they can try and prove themselves. Okay. Create a club. Here's where you can create a club and make it official. Awesome! So we can apply for the avant guards. Um, not qualify. Okay. What does it say? Skill. So you need a two and up for this. Joe Quan, Joe Quinn, whatever your name is. What does it say? Oh, he's the club leader. All right, all right. <clears throat> the parrot thaws is about partying. Okay. Uppercuts. <laughs> We're not really stuck up. We just doing frozen twice as long as it's food related. Yes, that is my life. Okay, club identity. Okay. Yeah, I think I know what's going on from here, so I'm going to skip. Okay, so our club name. Oh my gosh. Okay, so the members is Krista. Oh my gosh, look at all these random people. Oh. Oh my gosh, it's all the people from the Rice family. I hate this. I'm going to delete them all from the neighborhoods. <laughs> open invitation? Uh, I'll leave an open invitation for now. Our club hangout is... You know what, guys? I want to make my own club hangout. Okay, so our club hangout is going to be any. For now, it seems that they all get together at like parties. So we're gonna do any. <clears throat> yeah, we're gonna do any club members' house. We're chill and we like to hang out. Okay, our requirements. <clears throat> yes, admission requirements. <clears throat> You must be a young adult, because in order to party hard, you must be a young adult. Definitely. Career? Uh, we don't care about your career. Marriage was not married. You cannot be married in this club. Treat. The only thing is you have to enjoy partying, so... Skill level, no, no, no. Financial status, no, no, no. Could be any status. <clears throat> so yeah, those are our only requirements is to be not married and a young adult. Or yeah, I think I want them to, cause yeah, some of my people don't even have the same traits. All right, our activities. <clears throat> <clears throat> so we, in our club, we drink bar drinks. We eat. Oh my gosh, of course we eat. We dance. We party hard, basically. Um, watch live entertainment. Uh, I'm not sure if I really want that in there. And so basically, okay, art and music. 
fun and games. We play pub games. Oh snap. Um, we play all games. Social. Woohoo. Some people, not everybody, but some people. Home activities. Clean, fix the. And I want to say we try on outfits. Bathe and shower, bras. Kid activities. Um, well, we don't have any kids, so seven. Crack, roar. <laughs> roar! Yes, we love to roar. Lord Jesus. Social. Um. We like to. Bite. Oh my gosh. We like to. We like to hug. Nah. We like to tell jokes, of course. To everyone. Wait, let me review. Okay. We like to drink drinks. With certain people. Oh, I guess we can't choose. Can we eat with certain people? No. Can we dance with certain people? Can we woohoo with... No. I want to woohoo with certain clones. Or... I'm going to take woohoo out of here, actually. And instead of woohoo, put... We don't have anything outdoor. Oh my gosh, my part is so long. I need to stop this. Oh, we love to use hot tubs, but... Uh. Actually, yeah, we like to hang out by a fire. Is there an option for who? Okay. Things we don't do, and then we're going to have to probably end the... <clears throat> we don't look for frogs. That is something we don't do. <clears throat> we don't... Um, what do we don't do? We don't do spa activities, do yoga, medicate. <laughs> we don't read, that would be something for sure. We don't woodwork. Yeah, we don't woodwork. We don't do many things with our hands. Except for certain things. No, just kidding. <laughs> oh, we love being mischievous. Oh, you know what we don't do? We don't woohoo with elders or adults. We woohoo with our own age. <clears throat> and then <coughs> we don't sleep. Yes, no sleep. Oh, I hope you shower. <coughs> um, yeah, we don't fish. And one last thing we don't do is we don't play chess. Well, actually, we can play chess. Who cares? Actually, this is good. Yeah. We're cool with this. This is pretty good. <coughs> oh, I don't know what to name this club. So guys, make sure you give us club um, names in the description down below, and I will always change our club name. Our description is, can be any young adult with any lifestyle that just likes to chill, hang out, and turn up. Turn all the way up. Okay, um, basically, people who want to have fun. That does not say want, that says will want. club logo shall be a diamond yas 
Um, what's something that's just like cool? Fire! Yeah, we're fire. Oh, we had to name it. Okay, for now, we're just gonna name it. Ew, I wanna come up with some name. Um, cool name. Um, I don't know. For now, we'll just leave a good timers. Yes, we created our own club. Now, before we end this part, guys, because that is exactly what we're about to do. <clears throat> I'm going to invite Kalani. Oh, not to work out. No, we don't want you to work out with me. Ugh. I want to invite you to my club. Girl, if you don't stop working out. Wait, become a wagon. Welcome wagon. What? What's this? Whoa, what's going on? Is she a part of the club? What do we do? Welcome wagon. Wait, where's this girl? Girl, if you don't get off your computer. Oh, they're coming over. Ugh, I don't feel like talking to you right now. Okay, um, okay, you know what, invite her to the good timers, and then Kalani, coming out through the door, but, <clears throat> can I, huh? so we were, we will meet our neighbors, ooh, okay, hey Roy, we'd love to have you join the Paragons, what do you think, actually, we can join up to three clubs, so I would love to try it out. And Sobin is texting Aurora, welcome to the Parathons. I'm happy that you decided to join our club. We are having a club gathering and would love for you to introduce yourself to the group. And yet, um, uh, what is cool? You should meet us there. Do you want to join us? Yes, I'll be there. Okay, um, so I hope I can end the part and just, like, continue this later. Or if not, I'll just start part two. Let's find out. I'm so sorry about the long part. I'll try to shorten it by the best of my ability. Hey, who locked the door? Let me in. Keep unwanted guests out of your bay by locking. <laughs> bay. Oh, keep unwanted doors at your bay. Okay. Oh, can I end the game from here? Yes, I can. Okay, so guys, I hope you enjoyed this part, and we will explore the Paragons with Aurora in a little bit. Honestly, I don't think Aurora is anything like the Paragons, but um, I guess we'll check that out in a little bit. So, adios amigos and amigas and everyone else who's watching my channel. I hope you like, comment, and subscribe, and I just thank you so much for enjoying my videos.